What's up guys, this is BC Builds, and yes, this is True Lies, um, it's kind of irrelevant. Uh, today I wanted to show you uh, the newest mod on my setup, or whatever you want to call it, newest edition. Uh, yeah, I'm missing a cabinet there so you can see all the wires. Um, but there's my cable box, my uh, modem, or my router, the TV, my other screen, the rig setup and my computer and the charger um i'm a big forza player what's missing the xbox if you guys haven't figured it out by now well actually the other day my daughter broke my xbox cracked the shit out of the case and the disk drive kind of broke out you know i was pretty uh astonished that she could do that much damage at you know one and a half but anyways i couldn't fit it all back in the case correctly and make it look nice and you know, it just became an eyesore, so I decided to put it in my PC. I was going to go buy another PC case and just put it in there, but I figured why not try to add it to my existing PC, which is a uh, custom HP computer. I bought it at Best Buy, you know, uh, about six months ago. Then uh, I modded it, I swapped out the AMD for an i7. Uh, it has the original motherboard, it's 6 terabytes, and I think 256 solid state drive. Uh, it has a removable uh, hard drive for pictures and such. And yeah, nothing else too special. You know, I don't have a water cooling kit on it now. Well, I did, but you know, it was really unnecessary. And it took up too much space for, you know, the, now the Xbox is inside it with the PC. To show you guys how it works, turn the computer on. The TV will automatically switch. So you can see it's the computer. It should say HP on the screen. Okay, and I'm not sure what that's doing. Alright, whatever. As you can see here, I have two auxiliary switches. Uh, I added them onto this faceplate. That is actually for the Xbox. You see the green light illuminates. And Xbox kicks on. It's not only just two buttons and a glowing green light that'll tell you it's on. Yeah, it's a little dirty. I gotta clean around the buttons. There was a sticker there that I had to peel off. It's the sticker I do. I also have the left button, which is eject. So you guys, and I kept the. Damn it. The other PC bay too, the DVD drive, well, optical drive for the computer. You see? And that's about it. Uh, there's no plate on it on the side yet. The Second motherboard from the Xbox sticks out a little far, so I got to custom build a new side panel plate. Uh, it's all shit mess with the wires right now. I haven't run them all. You can see one sticking out the back. It's just a USB cable. Uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think. Uh, it's not the cleanest mod ever with the buttons being dirty and shit, but yeah, I think it's pretty nice. Thanks, guys.